going to have an exhibition. It's going to be Steelix versus Hammer Time for the last spot. What do you well, think? not the last spot, but the last spot for today of uh, the Invasion Championship qualifier. Which starts this Saturday. Yep, yep. So Singles start, uh, start off at 3.45. Yep. Um, doubles at 1 o'clock. But right now, we got Ling Ling and Chavo, as we said. Mm -hmm. Invasion Championship is then, like the weekly is now. Exactly. And right now, we got Ling and Chavo. Chavo off to a pretty solid early lead. Yep. 53%. This is going to be a very patient battle between these two. It definitely has the potential to be, but I mean, Chavo sometimes can really just... Chavo can play very aggressive yeah, with Bayonetta. Yeah, carried away, too. Sometimes Peach is just the perfect way for these combos. Yep. Oh, all right, Lingo. Oh, my goodness. Lingo for a couple of reads. A couple more, too. Trying to read just like an afterburner kick approach, but Chavo's taking it easy. Although he did lose his early lead, he doesn't really have a whole lot of reasons to approach here. Oh, looking for something. Yeah. Ooh. Chavo sometimes throws out those smash attacks for a punish, and I don't like that because they're very slow. That's true. I mean, Ling was able to get a spot a dodge out in time. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Speaking of spot dodge. Good. A solid read from, uh, from Ling there with the up smash. But Ooh, got big. the witch time. That's going to be Ling stock. Ooh. In the taunt. <laughs> you want to learn how to talk to a lady? Ask your mom. All right, big combo potentially for Chavo. Ling getting out of it, though. Ooh, that's like the forward air. forward smash. That forward smash is so strong. That's just a forward air, man. That's I mean, forward crazy. air, that's forward air. Is You're not even <laughs> wrong. It feels like a forward smash sometimes, man. Just an aerial version. Yeah. All right, nice dash attack extension. What is that crap made of for a forward air? Yeah, right? Oh, wow. Sweet empty hop to get that grab. And another Good. air dodge bait. Ooh. Chavo's getting something. Definitely. But that Nair breaks it up. Like, Link just negates it. Ooh, Link Ooh. swinging for the fences, but still safe. Another nice empty hop. Man. Chavo right. kind of getting beat up by him. Oh, pivot back grab the back throw? Looking like Ness Another with a stitch. Another back throw will probably kill. I don't know if we'll even live to see that. Ling's looking for a nice throw here. With That's a stitch. stitch. Oh. Ooh, but now Chavo's got it. Ooh, Chavo. Hey, That's back not going to matter with that no. back, back air. Very peachy indeed. All right, looks like we're going back to Smashville for game two. Whoa, 18% <laughs> from the Toad. <laughs> Lane calling out Chavo's aggressive approach. Which is interesting considering how much mileage Chavo got from the conservative approach in game one. That's definitely how Bayonetta tends to play, is very conservative, patient. Right. But Link still managed to call out the aggressive approach of that Toad star. Yeah. The problem with Bayonetta is that she doesn't exactly have too many approach options. Yeah. I mean, she typically has to space out, generally, or fade out attacks. Yeah, down throw, no bear, trying to get an air dodge in the pair. But... Oh, all right, I like that idea of Sling. Reading an afterburner kick, but Chavo not giving it to him. But got that forward air. Take that stock. Yeah, that forward aerial smash. Coming in hot. All right, big witch twist here for Chavo. Ooh, Chavo wants to definitely, Chavo definitely wants something out there. Yeah, he got stuck on the platform, though. Probably not looking for that forward tilt. Ooh, but, good yeah. wait by Link for oh. that witch time. Is he going? Air assault in there. Ooh, good. I like yeah. that. Yeah, Ling has been calling out a lot of afterburner kicks from the ledge, so we're trying yeah. to mix it up with fair into afterburner kicks from the ledge. Super smart. Get some good back air. Ooh, Chavo wants something. Ling with no float, so he's going to have to parasol early. Ooh, raw fair. Another forward air. Ooh. Damn, 
one. Missed attack. I think that was tackable. <laughs> oh, true, yeah. He was close, but not that close. Mm. Is this just in the headphones? Oh, so I get just blast. <laughs> I'll kill you at garbage. No. <laughs> One, go! <laughs> Alright, so back at it. Peach Bomber saving Link from what looks like a certain death. Wow, near the grab. Crazy conversion there. Man, chasing him down on that platform. Down smash to cover the frost up. Link still all over him with that Peach Bomber, but it actually ended up being... Good short combo there. Yeah. Combo. Exactly my thought. Another nice toad, but... When Shafo gets the lead, I would like to play more patient. I think he's playing a bit too aggressive against Peach. True, but the only time he had the lead was that game one, where he actually did take your advice. It kind of worked out for him. <laughs> but he just hasn't been able to get the lead in these last two games. No. And when you have a deficit like Chavos, and now you, you're looking for another read playing with, didn't quite get it. Chavo respected it, but. She and the fair coming in. Oh, Ling. And this is where Bayonetta struggles. She doesn't exactly have a good neutral. Yeah, but Chavo still found an opening, yep. and that's oh. going to be it. Ling with some uh, DI on that. Which looking was... like pre patch Bayonetta there. <laughs> yeah. You Still pull. Right Ooh. Another nice up to Ooh. Playing a little too aggressive there on stage. Yep. Ooh, it's light. Ooh, oh, Link's too low. Short. Link was too low. So Shabo keeps this winner's bracket side alive. Yep, the dream is not dead yet. Can you take two more games, though? That's how it starts, at least. Oh, ooh, we're getting a ditto match. So, I was interested to see if this would happen. Because mm -hmm. I've played Link's Bayonetta, and it's very good. And true, it's a very different beast than Chavo, though, as well. It's more patient than right. Chavo's. Chavo's is a more aggressive Bayonetta, and Link's tends to favor more towards the general metagame of Bayonetta, which is um, a patient style and bait out. Mm -hmm. I don't know, the thing is, is Link going to be Chavo with his, his main? Let's see. Has happened before. Oh my goodness, Looks like Ling Ling. swinging. Why do they call him Ling Ling, man? They should call him Swing Swing, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Just swinging out those legs. Exactly. Oh, all right. Goes to the grab, but Chavo... Oh my god. Chavo tries to wish time. Ooh, <laughs> wow. Just throws out two up smashes. Oh my god, Ling is uh, kind of in his head now. I don't even think yeah. it's like a Bayo Bayo thing. It's Ling versus Chavo. It's a re grab. Well, no it's Chavo, it's Ling. Chavo versus Chavo. <laughs> True. Alright, Ling taking that conservative approach that you had asked yeah. for, going from the ledge. And it's definitely working out. Yep. Oh, I don't know. I don't know what, the, what that witch time was about. I guess worked. he was expecting a dive Honestly, or like a slide. Well, no, because Ling did the bullet arcs, which does like would have gotten which time had Chavo done a little earlier. So he had the read, just missed the yeah. timing. But I'm not sure why he activated which time there. Well, maybe he was expecting the bullet art up there from Ling, but we'll never know. Chavo going for it again. Right. Chavo playing very aggressive. Yeah, at this point he has to. He's got a pretty solid deficit he has to overcome. Wow. Yes. Ooh, oh, right. very good. good. He's going to take this stock. Ooh, sure will. And he's at Super Saiyan percent. Let's see. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. oh down throw. Wow. Chavo's been going for that a lot, and he kind of gets punished for it. Yeah. Oh, my God. The bear yeah. caught him. Holding. Unfortunately. Caught him. Well, he's going to take that 3-1 with Chavo's own main. And there it is.